It's day two of the attempted murder trial that I'm attending, and it is literally the most absurd proceeding I have ever seen. We're on our lunch break, so the day is only half over, and it didn't start too bad for the prosecution. They made an opening statement, they explained a course of events that they said would lead to a conviction. The only problem is every witness they've called since has contradicted that course of events. The first person they called was a responding officer, and he didn't do a terrible job. He did contradict himself a few times, but that's actually fairly normal during testimony, because people don't always remember things exactly the same way, but what he clearly showed was he did not follow any policy or procedure. And the second witness was the alleged victim in this case, and just to really set the tone, as the jury was leaving, he was threatening the defendant from the stand. He contradicted himself repeatedly, he contradicted previous testimony, he contradicted things he had told the police, he just absolutely lost his mind. And the crazy thing is that the police just took his statements for granted and didn't do any investigation at all. It was actually on the defense to hire an expert that showed that everything the supposed victim said could not have scientifically happened. It is genuinely the most absurd thing I've ever seen in my life, and I'm going back for round two, because guess what? He's got to be back on the stand after lunch.